Okay, cool. So we're at Sweet Child of Mine. We're going to move from C add 9 to G this week. So. Now, when you're moving, you want to practice lifting up together, moving up, and pressing down together. Okay, so everything is in one motion. And when we switch back to the D, the third finger stays down. So we got G to D. So you want to go through the full pattern. D, C add 9, to G, back to D, and then start over. Now the strumming, okay, we have... We're going to add this now. So down, up, down. So it's going to be down. Switch chords. Back to D. So to get that up strum thing happen, you want to turn your wrist, and what you want to do is just practice going up. And 20, 30 times each chord. Just really rotating the wrist up is the trick to it. Now, for holiday, the power chord shape, we're playing the chorus now, which is F to the fourth fret of A to the fourth fret of E to the sixth fret of A. I'm going to repeat fourth fret, fourth, I was first fret to fourth fret, fourth fret of A. E, and now five times on the C, one, two, three, four, five, on holiday, and you're going to go back into the verse part. So I want you to play the verse twice, all the way through, the chorus once, and then the verse twice. <clears throat> you're going to get something called a capo so we can work on the, the uh, Paramore song, and then the train song was just a chord called an F sharp, so it's just like that first chord we learned in the chorus for holiday. You're going to move it up a half step. And then the second chord is you just pull back. So you're going like this. Down, up, down, up, down. And then switching chords. Down, up, down, up, down. 